25 to 70, 80 miles an hour, we're creating heat. When you run that battery down to propulsion stage, these batteries are hot. You gotta let them sit and cool off. If you don't, you're gonna kill the cell. But with our system storing the energy, these batteries never get hot. It never overheats. You don't have to shut the car down like with the Chevy Volt or no slamming the Chevy Volt. They were having issues. I went out and purchased a Chevy Volt personally and solved the problem, sent it to the lab. Everything was consistent. Let me ask you, introduce yourself if people want to know who you are. Good afternoon, Anthony Agnew, Chevy Volt 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 for EV technology, uh, and mother group now, uh, just wanted to tell you uh, we're very excited to do this pilot, this first pilot program here in Washington, D.C., my hometown. Uh, we can make a difference. Uh, and we believe that our test results will show that we have the secret sauce to solve uh, many of the challenges which are brought about with this new technology. India, Abu Dhabi, Dubai, Qatar, and North Africa, <clears throat> specifically cloud computers also, but with new technology, we can do a lot, and the uh, is so advanced, because the Saudi they are building recent uh, manufacturers in Saudi Arabia for the EV cars, and this technology comes very handy, and it's ready to be produced and manufactured in Saudi Arabia. I brought Ali with me, he was from Saudi Arabia, <clears throat> and yeah. he's going to be... My name is Ali. Uh, I was honored to meet uh, Lawrence today with uh, Mr. Hassan. Uh, and I'm going to be responsible for uh, representing the product there in Saudi Arabia and uh, acting uh, with Mr. Hassan there to take the product there and manufacture it in Saudi Arabia. Uh, Mullen, my day said he feel like I saved Mullen because all this going on. So I'll let him share the opinion. No, we are, I, I, I think one of the things that I would speak to bring a lot of those uh, technology in place, and I think they saved them, because uh, this technology going to make them more powerful, and they can market their, their, their vehicles and everything like that, and they need to save them. I, 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 can, I can see that, and I can say that. They saved more than the future market in the EV contract, and something like that, and they need to just be acknowledged, and they need to to be kind of uh, to be known that he is the one came and they wanted this technology to be placed in the mi mini cars and the, the mini vans and the little trucks, right? Yeah. Something like that. Right? Well, that's one of a kind. Yeah. Well, thank you. And I think these guys treated me to dinner, although I only well, owe you a salary because I couldn't pronounce nothing that was on the menu. So, well, I thought I was getting a country for a salad. <laughs> <laughs> I do appreciate it, guys. I finally came up with the we got the, 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 the Middle East market and the Pacific international market. And we really, really we're really looking well. forward to, to get it there. No, we're going to be successful there in the Middle East market. And once again, uh, Mother Sierra, we want to thank you as well. Uh, I will say again, uh, I'm not for any splitting, any shares. Uh, you know, I got a history of that. Uh, no stop shares and learning about it. I want everybody to reap their full benefits of their investments. And my job is to make sure of that. And the reason why I bring these parties on the street, I want you to hear from them so you know it's nothing fabricated, edited, whatever. This I is real and we're moving forward. For, for Muller to announce that they're using the technology, that's a good acknowledgement. Yes. And they know that. Yes. And yes. they understand that. And they, they've been kind of doing, doing all the best of their yes. purposes. And, yes. like that. and, and then, the thing <coughs> is, uh, you know, a lot of companies had an opportunity to do something, but they sit around and wait, who's going to make the first step? And now that they waited so long, the Middle East has come in and grabbed it. They're going to have the rights to anything outside the U.S. They're oh, promoting and right. pushing, putting it in the market. God willing, we're going to market the technology on yes. the seat. Yes. Specifically in the MENA. My job is to make sure that they follow through on the promises and commitments that they have made. They have brought in a great team, a lot of engineers, uh, some of the top in the country. And I admire them for that because it's kind of like myself. Keep quiet until you're ready to go. Don't call people to the kitchen to get a slice of the cake when it's still in the oven. I'm gonna come and get a slice when it's ready to go. This is not something, uh, everyone, that we just woke up one morning, they say, hire Lawrence Hart. 
there's a process. We've gone through numerous tests, validations. I mean, I was picked up because I had already gone through the proper certification, the various tests, uh, real-time tests with our vehicle. These companies have invested hundreds of millions of dollars in batteries and all end up with the same results. So what I created, everyone was investing all this money trying to build a better battery. So when I come along, it's kind of like when we introduced this, the companies were happy, but they were not happy. You have to, they have to explain their shareholders. We invested 20, 30 million, hundreds of millions in a battery. How do we explain to our shareholders, some garage inventor out of Mississippi, come up with a technology that cuts the battery costs in half and extends the battery technology mileage and distance from 75 to 300 percent based on the technology. Okay? And those that laughed at me and blasted me and thought I was like the boy that cried wolf, oh, you don't have nothing, you don't have nothing. Mullins, thank you. Because all I hear is crickets now. When those tests came back, all we hear is crickets. And now Mullins, thank you. Yes, we will be the next Tesla. And not only that, we're gonna let Saudi Arabia make their announcement, okay? And I'm at liberty to say this, because I had this on the table before Mullins come in, but now Mullins are a partner. And this is not what somebody said or what you heard, this is reality. $10 billion contract with Saudi Arabia. And more to come.